haven't got a rolling pen. Really? Hey everyone, welcome back. So what we've got here today is this no stress, no mess puzzle saver. So I don't really like jigsaw puzzles, but previously on a loot crate, I got this bad boy here, this Rick and Morty puzzle, which I absolutely love. It's fantastic. Love it, love it, love it. But my problem being is I had to make it in this lid of this box, and now at the minute it's just stuck in the lid of this box. Uh, and my girlfriend was like, hey, why don't you get one of those puzzle saving things? So that's what I got. I've got no idea how this works. I got a really, really nice email from the people I bought it from, from Amazon. They were like, hey, thanks for supporting me, guys. Thanks for bringing us some, you know, uh, buying our product. It's kind of like an indie product. So, you know, come and leave a review for us. It was quite nice. It was a nice touch. It was some, uh, apparently somebody claiming to be the, the director of the company. Let's see what it's all about. So, apparently, no stress, no mess, say goodbye to puzzle glue. It's supposed to do two times 1,000 puzzle pieces. So this is a 300 puzzle, so there's definitely going to be ample here. I've got no idea how it works. I'm assuming that it's going to be able to get this sorted. That's why it's in here, because most people build the jigsaw into something. You can't build a jigsaw in reverse, obviously. So let's just get this open. I'm going to carefully open the box in case the box is used as a way to actually transfer the jigsaw, because I'm assuming the jigsaw needs to be flipped upside down to actually use this. Ooh, ripped it. Um, some hanging things. I've used 3M sticky stuff, that's quite good. Peel off back here and move from... Oh my god. Are these all exactly... This is... They all... Right, let's get rid of the box. These are all exactly the same. Peel off packing, peel off packing. So let's read. So flip your assembled puzzle over so the back is... Okay, so that is the first problem with this product. Is that it wants me to flip the jigsaw so that it's face... Uh, with the picture side down. So that's a problem. What would have been nice is some way to actually get this jigsaw the other way around. Uh, just bear with me, I need to grab something. So we've got the, the other box lid. Uh, I was hoping it was going to fit inside that. Uh, bars. Do these. See, the, my problem being is, if I try and flip this out, it's probably going to go everywhere, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> I'm just going to go for it really fast and hope that this isn't the end of the video. Oh, so, okay, I've done it. Okay, so the picture is now face down. So that's that's a really big issue with this product, actually, is that you've got to have your jigsaw like this that's stupid you know let's be fair you're not going to build your jigsaw backwards with no picture on it whatsoever uh, anyway so we recommend sandwiching the puzzle in between two pieces of cardboard and flipping it over onto its back if any pieces come loose simply replace them before step two. Oh yeah because i know exactly where a piece goes when all is is gray Okay, anyway, with the picture side with pictures side down, lay out the permanent adhesive sheet on the puzzle bank to see how many I will need to apply them to uh, is that two? I reckon I reckon I can get away with two there. You'll be able to preserve one or one to two, three hundred or five hundred piece puzzles or one one thousand piece. Wait, wait, wait a second here. So it says on here, just here, or one 1,000 piece puzzle with the materials enclosed. This says two 1,000. So what? Huh. It's looking false advertising, man. Come on. Done in minutes. I think not. Okay, anyway. 
Uh, peel off your juice of backing, so whereabouts? Okay, so that's the backing, presumably. So it looks like. Well, I need a rolling pin. How am I got a rolling pin? Really? Improvise. Foil. Okay. Uh, do not extend the adhesive sheets beyond puzzle edges. Keep the adhesive edge away from what? 0.3 centimeters away from the puzzle edge. So, in actual fact, it's got to be inside the puzzle. So, it's not at the actual edge of the puzzle, it's off to the side. Uh, for unique sizes, trim as needed. So, get the knife back. Okay, I'm going to score along there so we can see where we need to go. And then we're just going to trim this. So here's my problem, destroy the jigsaw, luckily the pieces have all held together. Okay, so, pull that off, okay, that, then first the Roll pin. I'm just gonna rub because I don't want to ruin my foil. And oh, I feel the crunch. Okay, so I can get away with using just two of these sheets. I don't know how I can. I suppose it is stuck. There might be a slight amount of overlay here. I don't know. Can use other cylinders like a can of hairspray, empty for a jar. Oh, use some tin foil. Be firm when rolling. While it is a seal, seals the puzzle immediately. The bond will become stronger with time. It is best to let your freshly sealed puzzle sit for a few hours before handling it. After this time, flip the puzzle back over and enjoy. What if I want to cover it in foil? Okay, good thing that. science we're going to flip it now okay now you see that now I know it said the bond would grow with time but that still seems a little bit too flexible if you ask me it's nice that it's preserved the puzzle don't get me wrong but yeah don't know I mean what do you guys think it's it's there you can see it's still the puzzle so as you can see on the back, you leave a space around the edges. I'm not sure why that is. Uh, I don't know if I'd want to. It's quite flimsy, actually. But we'll put a hanger on it anyway. Let's get one of these off. Like I said, it's quite good that it comes with these hanger things. I don't know it came with these bits so it could be hung. If I can pull off the glue. And is it upside down? So, 
I mean, it's worked. Let's get the puzzle together. I'll give it that. Uh, it costs seven pounds, I believe, from Amazon. I got it with Amazon Prime, so I didn't have to pay for delivery. Don't know if I'd buy it again, though. I don't know why the instructions say it's one 1,000 jigsaw puzzle and the box says two 2,000 for the pieces. I'll be asking about that. Why would it say inside? Unless these have come from a 1,000 piece. So anyway, there it is, the puzzle saver. Let's grab the box, see what it was actually called. The No Stress No Mess Puzzle Saver by A Great Life from Amazon. I'll leave this and see if it gets... Jesus Christ. Like, I mean, that could just be the puzzle, the jigsaw itself that's a bit weak and flimsy, but we'll just leave it flat for a couple of hours and then we'll see what happens. But I think it's probably going to be the same. I can't imagine the glue is going to be able to stick that much better than what it is already. Give it a rub. Well, guys, hope you enjoyed that. I'm a little bit annoyed by that, to tell you the truth. It, it works, but it's just, it's not that great. The fact you've got to flip your jigsaw puzzle yourself is a little bit annoying. There should have been something in there, like the box should have opened up to be something that can like go on the puzzle that helps you flip it. So yeah, if you want to get this, build your jigsaw upside down so you can't see the picture, and then it might work. Well guys, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.